Hello everyone, my name is Matt, and we're doing something a little different today. Uh, I am going to be playing Vampire Survivors with my uh, girlfriend here, Sarah. Say hello. Hi. Yes. Hi. <laughs> so I usually play uh, retro games, or that's what I've been posting on YouTube, but uh, this is a new game. It's from... Uh, I believe it started in 2001, but it didn't get really popular until 2002, or well-known. And uh, it's it's uh, really, uh, it's, uh, bleh, bleh. <laughs> it's been selling really well on Steam, and it's got really good reviews. And uh, I just bought it this week. For five bucks so I think it's worth every penny I don't know if Sarah thinks so but yeah uh, and you said we're on switch oh yeah this is on switch it's for a lot of platforms it's even on it's a, also a mobile game as well so uh, enough yakking I'll let's start playing all right, so the first thing we're going to do is go to our power-ups so you can see what we have so far. Um, we have 984 gold pieces, so we'll probably do another max health. What do you want to start next? I don't know why anyone would put money into curse. I don't get that. Unless you have to do it to get something unlocked, probably, right? Yeah, probably. Alright, so what do you want to, we have 205, you want to save up for the next thing? Yeah. We have to. Where's my cursor? Oh god. Yeah, it's all pretty, it's all filled in. Okay. So I'm gonna go up, 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 up. So, basically it's a skill tree, and it, when you want your, you can hit refund power-ups and you get all that gold back. So the more you play, the more gold you earn, so you can have more things checked off. So, yeah. So if you're wondering what the different things are, we have Might, which makes your damage higher. Armor, obviously, decreases the damage we take. Max Health increases our health points. Recovery recrease, increases the HP we regenerate over time. Cooldown reduces the cooldown times for our different weapons, etc. The speed makes our projectiles faster, which is so crazy fun. Uh, amount is, I think, my favorite thing. So you get an extra one of your projectiles. So instead of starting with one, you start with two. Movement speed is great because then you can try to outrun the monsters trying to kill you. Magnet increases the range that you pick up. So you'll see how that works. Alright, so here we go. Now we have to pick our characters. I've been playing a lot of Pasqualina. She has really awesome projectiles and the only downside of her is you start out without an aim detect so you're just kind of avoiding monsters and hoping that you hit them with your your little thing. I'm going to do Po Racho, <laughs> and uh, he's cool because he starts off with garlic, and uh, it's like a force field. You start off with a force field around you, and uh, now that I'm looking at it again, the garlic kind of looks like, like a butt. testicles or no, something. Like a butt. <laughs> Go daddy. Up, up. Our pug wants to sit in Matt's lap, and that has that's his guy. So, All right, we're going to start in the mad forest. I'm red, Matt's blue. So the little crystals are your experience points. When you start out, like we knew nothing, we were just like, I don't know how to do this. But you get the hang of it, so. And uh, all the weapons fire, or you have no control over your weapons. Yeah, the only thing you can do is move. Yeah. And click what you want to select. For when you up, when you level up, when your blue bar is full, then you get to select. So I'm gonna pick 
Santa water, which is basically holy water, and uh, you'll see what happens. It's it basically basically casts out two areas where if an uh, enemy runs into them, they take damage. And uh, further into the game, it kind of becomes a force field a little bit, or it slows down the enemies quite a bit. And any of the pyres of fire give you um, items or coins. There's like rosaries and vacuums and all kinds of cool stuff. Hit the bats with your force field, or your aura of garlic breath. The the blue little, the blue little gems. I don't know if we I mentioned this. Already. Okay. Experience, and then the bar at the top is your experience. All right, I'm gonna increase my projectile speed. I could really use like a weapon that I can aim. I recorded this earlier, but we ran out of. <laughs> Uh, disk space, so it's kind of weird recording this over again, but it's worth it. <laughs> well, we're playing again, so yeah. nothing can stop us. Short, yeah. Shortly after we found out that it's not recording, we died. <laughs> duplicator! Uh, yeah, duplicator. So I get three holy waters now. Well, anything you fire. So if you get another oh, weapon, yeah. I'd really like you to come kill some things, because I can't. Really like a magic wand or something. There we go. Lightning ring! Or I could do friendship, which helps us both. I'm gonna be selfish and do lightning ring. I, um... I played earlier today and I maxed out Lightning Ring and it is so cool. Sarah actually got to uh, 30 death. minute mark, yep. I yeah, played. the game kind of, the game ends at 30 minutes when Unless, death yeah, comes for you. Reaper comes. If you can beat the Reaper, you keep playing. <coughs> I am going to level up my water. Come save me. Quit running away from them. Run into the bats. Kill the bats. Yes, dear. Indeed. Well, they're super easy to kill. No. The chicken-looking thing is called floor chicken. It's health. All right. I could get a whip. Out of everything, I'd probably take the whip. So now I can kill the stuff that's in front of me. But it's slow, so I have to level it up. You'll see our um, health bar slowly regenerate. That's part of our skill tree, which is nice. There you go, like popcorn. Just keep running through them pools. So, I just picked up a red money bag because gold is great. I'm gonna upgrade my garlic to make my breath stinkier. I mentioned earlier that this game gives me a uh, gauntlet vibes but I'm not I haven't played that game in a long time so I may be way off on that I just I remember there being a lot of like enemies in gauntlet I don't know if I'm rem remembering that correctly or not and uh like, graphically it kind of looks like Castlevania. Alright, I am going to do the Holy Bible. It'll spin around me and and hit people. Or hit monsters, which will be nice, like in my own little force field. I also maxed that out when I played at noon. So I, it was just it was so chaotic. But it was it was beautiful. I think most of the difficulty in this is finding a good uh, setup. Or yeah, you have to pick your items carefully. Like, if you want to upgrade everything as much as you can, as fast as you can, because you're going to need it as things get more difficult. 
So treasure chests are great. We share the money, which is nice. And then one of us will get an upgrade. So you got your holy water upgrade. So you are level three already. Oh. Ah. I'm stuck on a skull post. I, it, it, if you maneuver yourself, you can get around mobs. Like, they're not as scary as... Like, yeah. the more you play, you learn that everyone's kind of got, like, an area around them you can get through. And certain mobs are easier to kill than others, so... Um, Plus like, there's... Oh, I'm sorry. No, you're fine. Plus there's really no random movement. You kind of know where the enemies are going to go because they're always coming for you, so you can kind of... Plus, a lot of them are more slow moving. So. Well, we have fast, we have speed increase, so that it yeah. makes them slower. If you don't have any speed, like when you first start out and you have no buffs, like no skill tree points or anything, it is like wow. Like I don't know. I feel like you move a lot slower. Yeah. It's, like if There's... we took all our bonuses off, I have a feeling we'd be like, that's really bad. Like it's noticeable. I want to kill this guy. Come out me. This one's really nice. Ooh, purple. The graphics aren't that impressive in this game, but the, I think all the, like, I like the, it. the gameplay is really impressive. Okay, so I upgraded my whip and my lightning ring twice. You're about to see a whole bunch more lightning. The uh, developer is an Italian guy, and he he used to work developing uh, things for gambling, like uh, those ele machines. electronic fruit machines where you pull the lever and oh, in America, and, it's slot machines. Yeah, but I like slot machines. Calling them fruit machines because it's British and it sounds way better. So when you open a treasure chest, you can kind of tell from there that he worked as a del... A, well, I don't know if it was a developer for gambling machines, but that was his previous job. I said this before, but this game did come out in 2001, but it didn't really become popular until like 2022, uh, when a person on Twitch streamed this and uh, really liked it, and then it became really popular on Steam. That's a problem when you're... Oh, there's a treasure chest. What was that game that you mentioned earlier about the huge armies? Oh, Dynasty Warriors? Yeah, Dynasty Warriors. This game kind of gives me those vibes if it was like a... Just a swarm like of Like a third guys. person game, yeah. The kill count is, is big. And like I said before, I was always sucky at the that game. I'm up to level 5 for my room. Oh, and I leveled up. Nice. I'm gonna upgrade. 
Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the friendship amulet because it'll help me and it'll help you and then it'll just be more painful for them. We do have recovery too, so that We're helps. slowly regenerating yeah. HP, which is helpful. I'm assuming if you're watching this, you have some kind of video <laughs> game knowledge. But no, sure. some t I mean, I have a lot of art friends, so if I link to it, they might just be popping in to see what I'm up to. I just got an orb, which is a vacuum, I believe, and it's gonna bring all the HP tokens to me, which is so awesome. Spellbinder. Unless you wanted something else. Level up. Yeah, we're sucking up so much X XP that we're leveling up. Bing, bing, bing. Isn't that nice? I love that. It's like... Power! One of our dogs is now like sound asleep after chewing his bone. The other dogs, like, I'm never gonna stop chewing this bone. Actually, it's a, it's a, no, oh, what's it called? I just bought them. They are not, we don't do raw hides anymore for, because one of ours pulls off chunks of stuff and I'm worried he's gonna have blockage. Um, oh, help me out here. We were doing bully sticks. And we switched to, stay. oh, collagen sticks. They're supposed to be really good for joints, and um, Dipper's five, and he's a Chewini mix, so, you know, sore joints could happen. Well, that one that's supposed to be good for their everything. These guys in the red shirts are easy to kill, these bats are not as easy. I've been splitting this channel between my art and, Ill well, art slash illustration videos and uh, these gaming videos and the gaming videos have been doing a lot better so I don't know what the future holds for well it's kind of like channel. the world according to Matt I know it's kind of it's kind of a sin as far as in the YouTube world to split no, it is. The, a channel between oh, like Lord. two different things but I don't know I Matt like likes posting art what and I video want. games, and we have pets, so who knows? Maybe he'll get a puppy video. Well, they always say stick to one thing for a channel, because mm. people don't, people who like your game videos won't like your art videos. Yay! Huh. I got one more bibble. All right, I got more garlic. I should probably update my. Do I have my? Do I have crosses? No, I have bibles. I, I have bibles. Oh well, yeah, just <laughs> I, I just have garlic. Shoes, people, I don't want to die though. Let's go down here. Pick up some of these XP. Let's go back down to that light. The eleven minute mark. It's bone time. Hey, I want to. I want to do. Okay, let's move up. There's, well, we're not moving up, we're moving away. Alright, let's move away then. I love the sound, it sounds like popping popcorn. Yay! Yep. We popped a mantis! Let's see what we get. We got... Matt's Holy Water! Yay. What, up to, what are you up to? Level 5. Good. We can hide. Gonna do more garlic. I can use Matt as my shield. Which way do you want to go? Down a little. Let's pick up as much as we can. There's a lot of, lot of experience over here. Mm. 
we need that for red. Alright. Matt, what are you uh, picking? Garlic? I'll do this one. And I'll get my lightning ring. Oops. Still going to if you ever see any of these red things, make sure you get them because we get tons of experience for picking them up. Alright. Um, get my holy bibble. This is when it starts to become sensory overload. <laughs> but this it, isn't even the worst yet. Yeah, this is bad, but this is nothing, so. I think I maxed out the garlic now. I It'll think. mutate into something, or evolve into something. Else. Don't leave me. Mm -hmm. We need that light to the fire. Oh, I'm gonna die. Help me. Where is it? Where's the fire? Oh, it's just a coin. I'll just stay with you so I don't die. I was getting brazen and like <laughs> werewolf latched on to me. This is I hate when that happens. Chewing on my leg. This is a good Halloween game. Yeah, it's got everybody. Oh. I have to hide my map so I don't get murdered. Alright, this is when I'm suddenly on. getting crazy. Nope, got, oh. We I walked right look. into the giant. We walked right into the giant werewolf. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, so, that's cool. Look at the DPS on my rune tracers. Look at that. That's damage per second. 193.2. Let's see, map. 100.2 for holy water. Hmm. Alright. Want to play again? Yeah, let's do another one. Alright. Let's see and what we can do for our power. This will be the last one for the video. Or do you want to unlock a new person? Oh, uh, let's just build up something here. Let's do maybe duration. That seems like a good one to... You want to do that one? Okay. I like vacuum because I hate picking stuff up. <laughs> We have enough we can do. Alright. Porta Ladonna is that looks like the lightning ring. Permanent thirty percent air, yeah. We got Mortasio. I heard I saw on a YouTube video title that he can change into a different character, which is kinda cool. Hmm. Cr crotchy <laughs> starts with one revival gains one more revival crotchy. at level 33 Frito <laughs> Crotchy Frito Frieto? Fre 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 Frieto? Um, he has the cross I'm uh, I really like when this upgrades all the way but I'm going to try someone different I'm going to do I'm going to do I'm gonna do a Melda. All right, who are you gonna do, Matt? I will do. Uh, I'll do the nun. <laughs> Looks like a nun to me. The cleric. Yeah, we. I unlocked hyper mode, whatever that is, and I'm too afraid to try it because it doesn't sound at all like it's survivable. The lovely thing about Melda's magic wand is it targets the nearest enemies, which is really cool. Oh, I could do range. And tracers. my character has temporary. The range of the weapon is bigger. Like, as you can see, the holy water is spread out like huge. <laughs> yeah, it's like a. a but that buff. Oh, that only lasts for. Temporary buff. Yeah, I think. When I upgrade it, it goes away. It might just be a certain amount of starting time, too. Would you upgrade? 
Or what'd you pick? The whip. The whip is nice because um, it goes forward and back. So if you're, you know, people are crowding around, you can create some space. Especially good when it's big like this. <laughs> I like the, um, oops. Um, ooh, fireball. Getting some enemies to this. Yeah, get the fireball and there's nobody. <laughs> Oh, there's a bad guy I want to kill. Any of the glowing bats in the beginning are boss, like mini bosses or whatever you want to call them. So you get a treasure chest. Matt upgraded his holy water. Alright. Should I do my other way? Uh, I will do more whip. Yeah, just stick with like, just worry about upgrade. That's what I started, like instead of getting other weapons, if you have like one halo weapon, one distance weapon, so you have your, like do whip, then maybe the Bible or the cross, and then like just worry about upgrading the skills. They can max out, then they like evolve. I didn't mean to eat the turkey, I mean chicken. Floor chicken. I like that the developer called it floor chicken. I think it looks like turkey, but it's officially called floor chicken. More Bibles! Pretty soon I'll have a force field of Bibles and no one, no one will be able to bite me. Wants to be around a bunch of Bibles anyway. Yeah, <laughs> yeah alienate all our followers. Ah, they're in my hair! <laughs> Dark. You could do the lightning ring for your distance, or you could do cross to protect you. Close up. I do cross. Actually, if you could do all distance, you could have the holy water and the lightning going, that'd be pretty sweet too. Idea for future. What does the pentagram I don't know. Oh. No, I'm not picking it up. I unlocked the pentagram mm. when I got to 30 minutes, so we're still not mm. sure of its Coolness. function. Yeah. Mm. Like, is it like, does it do its thing often, mm. part of the time? Oh, there's a fire down here. I don't mm. know. Oh, just coins. And you'll notice that like there's an area that the enemies can touch you and you can get pretty close to them without them actually inflicting any damage. But as the enemies get stronger, it's like, oh god, they're getting closer. Alright. Reduces weapon cooldown. That will be helpful, especially with my Bible. I'm killing this back because I want a treasure chest. Come help me kill this bat so I get a treasure chest. Oh! Got it! It wasn't a treasure chest, it was a red orb of experience. More holy water! More! Let's go as much as we can. We should go by that fire and see if we get a vacuum. Vacuums are cool because they suck all the experience from all around. One more projectile! To the fires! Keep going. Hmm? Keep going, look for more fires. Ooh, I froze time. My nun alone. Mm. Ain't none of your 
business. Vacuum. We're gonna level up super fast right now. I love it. I'm gonna do the friendship amulet. Because we're friends! Best friends! Has anyone seen the in-betweeners? Gotta keep that ship afloat. The friendship. What's that from? <laughs> oh, yes. Simpsons. If Matt quotes it, it's from The Simpsons. Perfect god. Mantis. We get. I have a feeling it's gonna be holy water for Matt. It seems what like tonight's theme is holy water for Matt. Oh, it's my Bible. Wow. Level three bibbles. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> my horrible Owen Wilson. Not sure that was Owen Wilson. <laughs> oh, did I say Owen Wilson? I meant. Uh, whoever Wilson. it sounded like. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go this way. Ooh, vacuum? Owen Wilson, my lawyer. Vacuum! Oh. Alright, I'm gonna do it. Alright. Oh! Well, that's what that does. Is that, like, it? <laughs> like, it's a once-use thing? That stinks. Well, now we know. Maybe it has a really long cooling there. It seemed to like clear the whole board, maybe. Doesn't it? Like, there doesn't seem to be nearly as many. Yeah, that's what it does. It clears. Oh, I like it. I just keep heading towards the fires. I don't know what Matt's like thing is. I'm, I'm just, just following you. Yeah, I go fire to fire and just trying to get items that help me level up. And my goal is to not die. I'm just a nun following the lady. And does that mean I'm Mother Superior? Uh. Or Lady Superior? I'm beautiful. I have a magic wand. I have flying crosses that can kill people. Imagine if you were a vampire hunter though, like how- Ooh! It is, like, it's got a cooldown. Told you. Well, how was I to know? Like, guessing it and knowing it is two very different things. Whoop, I got bit by a vampire. Or a werewolf. Where are you? I'm in my own... Holy water. Ooh. I'm taking a bath in my holy no, water. No, do the spinach. You want to do more damage. Back, back, I say. Back from the spawn. Yeah. Oh, to me, the, the spinach looks more like mint, but okay, whatever. <laughs> Why do I keep getting these friendship things? Oh, I'll do it again. I'm so nice, aren't I, Matt? Helping um. you level up. Yes, dear. Watch for red and boss guys. Die, skeleton guy. Hernk, hernk, hernk. I don't know where the hernk, hernk thing I do is. Maybe I'm trying to like honk, honk. I don't know. But I, it just, it started and I can't stop. There's this kid that I went to school with in... Uh, junior high that used to go dun, dun. <laughs> maybe it's yeah wah, wah. like it's just a judgmental dun, dun. Durka, durka. Yeah. that's a pile of gems I oh. wonder what happens if that happens during the uh, reaper fight yeah you just luck out I guess. <laughs> zing oh. My holy water. So if you freeze holy water and make like projectiles that have a sharp point, so they're like darts, kind of like, that'd be, hey, if it anyone would, wants to make a vampire movie, that's, that's my idea for a weapon. 
Cube. Ice cube arrows. What are you gonna pick? Candelabra. Sure. Start pimp up your larger area affected by your already strong weapon. Where are you? Gotta move. Go pick a direction. Down. Die, big bats. The these they bats are the worst. Mm. Unless you're like super pimped with like strong attacks, mm. the bats are really these big bats are bad. Big bad bats. I don't like them. Good thing you can. Yay! Thank you. Nope, oh, they're back. I'll keep moving. Yes, ma'am. Guys in the nope. red. Oh. There's a treasure chest, hence the arrow on the side of the screen. I can't read this. Oh, we're nope. Never mind. <laughs> we're blocked in. There's probably an opening here soon. Just keep working it. Mm. Mm. You're all right. Just watch your spacing. And draw them off. I know it seems mean that I would just leave him there, but he's done it to me so <laughs> often where he's like, I found an opening, I'm out of there. I was like, wait, for me. I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, I upgraded your whip. Yay. Cleric power. Eat cross. I really want to kill that mantis so I get his experience and his treasure chest. Which way do you want to go? Let's go. Oh. Hmm. I guess up. Up, up, and away. 11 minute mark. Are we strong enough to get through these? We I'm are. a nun with a whip. I can do anything. Yeah. Ooh, purple. <laughs> Man, I didn't do anything. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Who gets what? I get... Um, stronger weapons, another projectile, more bibbles. Level six, level two, oh, cooldown reduce. That's very nice because that reduces cooldown for my pentagram too. Level two laurel. All right, let's go. Whoa, I'm in the bad guys. Lots of bad guys. Let's get that fire. To the fire, to the window, to the wall. Don't think about it. The funny thing is, the lady I worked at at the museum, who like I always took as being like so conservative and like like just like kind of I don't know. I don't want to say uptight because that sounds rude, but she was just like very proper. Like she posted a thing on Facebook with that song, and I was like, what? Ooh, replicator, Dupli yeah. Duplicator. Open up the replicator. My duplicator. My duplicator is functional. What are you gonna pick? Holy water, do it. Oh, I must have picked up something too. Whip. 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 <laughs> whip. Whip. Nene. Nene. Watch me whip. Whip. Watch me nene. The werewolf. Eat man. it. Eat it. See, we get cocky and then we're gonna die. Uh, cool down reduced. Let's do it. Yes. <laughs> Which way do you want to go? Up? Eight, left, down, what? Oh. I don't go. I'm following you. Right. 
away from the enemies. Away. <laughs> a lame quote. Love it. I've trained him well. All right, so all his quotes aren't Simpsons. All Simpsons. A lot of them are Simpsons. Like, the first ten years of our relationship, it, he'd say something. I'd be like, are what's from, that from? Are from the first ten years of the Simpsons. Yeah, and it, he'd be like, Simpsons. He'd be like, well, you should probably know that by now. Ooh, your crosses are just like... Ooh. For you, Chuck. Come for your daughter, Chuck. I don't even know what that's from. Do you know what that's from? Yes. What? Uh, God, Beetlejuice. Very good. You got a candelabra level too. That increases the range of your stuff. Mm. Escape. Keep it going. Up, up. Oh. Cross. Move it, move it, move it. Keep moving. Nice. Work through the ghosts. Stay away from the packs of werewolves. Did we say in this one that it's a good Halloween game yet? I think if we didn't, did. it is. <laughs> it has everyone. It has ghosts, werewolves, mummies, plants. Why are you so injured? Because I was running into a bunch of werewolves to get out of there. Mm, Plus the ghosts. Keep going. I'm not completely immune to the ghosts. Oh. God. Bring on match. Need some floor chicken. <laughs> Alright, well, keep moving. We'll find some. Stay away from things that hurt you. I'm trying. That's the that's the name of the game. I'm trying to shield you with my Bible, so I'm doing the best I can. I think I'm doing a pretty good job. Yep. <sighs> Everyone's gonna get a level up. Hopefully that'll help save us. There. Yeah. Yeah, but then they're just Sweet. right back again. Sweet relief for, for one second. Seconds. Come on. Come on, chicken. Oh, you're over here. No. I didn't mean to eat. Ah, I'm dead. Almost. I can't. Honey. I'm dead. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Stay in the water. No. Uh, all right. Well, we didn't get to death this time around. Fifteen but... minutes isn't that shabby. Like, look at uh, look what we did get through. All right. We'll keep working on our strategy. And you guys have a good evening or a good day whenever you see this. We appreciate your viewage, and we'll talk to you later. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye.